Hello, 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 Lady Terry B. Jones here on Sunday with What the Scriptures Say Guide, where we are memorizing scriptures. And the scripture that we're memorizing is Galatians 5, verses 22 to 25, which is the characteristics of the fruit of the Spirit, right? Where we walk not after the flesh, but we walk after the Spirit. Okay, and for those of you who have not downloaded this guide, click the link before so that you too can join in with us that are memorizing scriptures, right? And on today, which is Sunday, okay, uh, what is, is no actual activity to be done on this particular Sunday, but next month on the fifth Sunday in October is when you as a youth ministry, as a group, as a family, uh, however you choose to gather with others to show them that you actually memorize Galatians 5, 22 to 25, okay? And so what we do at the Life Church is we pin those who have memorized those scriptures, right? With a, a button, all right? And so for those who are participating online, and those who are part of my email, uh, subscribers, and for those who are participating through YouTube channel, Facebook, and all of the different other measures, I will send you a certificate of completion that you memorize these scriptures, okay? And so make sure to be ready. Just be ready on that day. And so why, you know, are we memorizing scriptures, okay? And it's very important for us to build a relationship with Christ so that we can do what he has put us on this earth to do, which is to go ye into all the world and compel men, okay, to give their lives to Christ, basically, okay? To repent of their sins, uh, to accept his finished work, which is his death, burial, and resurrection, okay? And so that's our whole goal in life, right? Is to win souls for Christ. It doesn't matter how it's done, whether it's done by memorizing scriptures so that when you go and interact with people, you will feel confident and comfort uh, and, and, and knowing, you know, that you are bringing the gospel to somebody, okay? The lost, those who don't know Christ, those who are struggling with life situations, those who get ready to just throw in the towel and think this is the end of the matter. There is life in Christ, okay? And so that's what we're here to do. Now that we, you know, are, have partaken of this life, we want others to experience this same Zoe life, the same love, the same joy, the same peace, right? That is talked about in these scriptures, right? And so... Uh, definitely download this here. And for those who know, basically, I, I think I shared with you guys that I created a Bible trivia uh, board game here. <clears throat> and so what I want to do on next month is on the sec on October the 10th, which is a Tuesday, right? A Tuesday night. I want to host an online Bible trivia with a twist game event featuring my board game here. Now he's like, how in the world are we gonna play a board game and we're all over the place? Okay, just put in the comments, me, okay? And I'll reach out to, to, to you to let you know how we're gonna move forward with doing this. Now I want a minimum of 10 people to participate in this for this to, uh, for me to move forward with having this online game day, okay? And so go ahead on and like, subscribe, share this with others. So those who don't know Christ, those are, who are in Christ, you know, maybe they have, are in a backslidden state, you know, they're not serving the Lord like they were, you know, and so they just need to be brought back, you know, to the light, okay? And so that's what you want to do. You want to get the word in you so that you'll know what to say, right? You'll know who to uh, approach because God is going, you know, to give you the strength and the power, the discernment, right? And the clarity, you know, the vision to know what it is you need to say and do and who you want to approach, all right? And so in the meantime, go ahead on and give someone a hug, show someone a smile and let someone know that Jesus loves them and you love them too, okay? And until tomorrow, I'll be sharing with you Monday scripture memorization technique. 
Enjoy the rest of your Sunday.